Hello everyone, my name is Miss Linda and today I get to share with you one of my very favorite lessons, popsicle stick people. The best part of this lesson is you get to play with your popsicle stick person after you're finished. Here is one that I made and I'm going to show you how to make these together and here's another one. Um, what's nice about this lesson is you can also turn these into ornaments if you'd like to. For the holidays you can make reindeer you can make snowmen or even a cute little bear. So the difference between the popsicle stick ornaments and people is the string that you can hang them on. And if you'd like to hang the string on one of your people, you can do that as well. So let's get started. I'm going to show you our material list. So the materials you're going to need are a pencil, Glue, I like to use tacky glue. A Sharpie pen. Scissors. A popsicle stick. Now you can use a large popsicle stick or you can use a smaller popsicle stick. a small googly eyes, and little pom-poms. You're going to need some flesh-colored felt. And you don't need a lot, you just need a little bit. Some twine or string. and assorted papers. So colored papers, construction paper, whatever you choose. Okay, so my first step is I have my popsicle stick. I'm just gonna put that aside. Um, and I'm going to use my felt for the flesh color. Now what I wanna do is keep in mind that I wanna make the arms <clears throat> and the head and I want to make sure I have enough room in the whole, in my piece of felt. So um, the arms can be done in two ways. We can use them as like almost like little mitts with arms, or we can use them as if it's looking sideways here um, and showing the thumb and fingers. So what I want to do is I'm going to make a long, um, rectangular piece. I'm going to cut it out with my scissors along the edge. And what I like to do, if I have two things, I'm going to use it. Um, I'm going to cut it once and kind of double it. So I'm going to take this, I'm going to take, I'm going to fold it in half and I'm going to cut it so that now I have two pieces. So all I really need to do is cut once um, with two pieces because I have two arms. So I'm going to use my Sharpie and I'm going to kind of do the best I can to draw on this piece of felt to give it a look that it's hands and an arm. So it's kind of hard to see here. So just do your best. I'm going to cut along. I'm just going to round out. This is where my hands are. So now I can keep them like this, or I can make little thumbs. I think I'm going to try and make little thumbs, but this is too difficult. It's okay. So I cut a little slit there and another slit there, and I'm just going to pull that out and just kind of round it off. You can also use 
colored paper. That's a nice alternative too. So now I have my two hands and now I'm gonna make my face. So what I wanna do for the face is I'm using an oval shape. An oval looks like a circle that's squished. So I'm gonna cut it out. I'm gonna use my hand, helper hands going to help turn the felt so that my scissor hand can hold it in place. Okay. And it doesn't have to be a perfect oval. It's kind of nice if it's a little different. So now I'm just going to kind of align it, put it on my popsicle stick. Eh, that's pretty good. And then the hands are going to be somewhere over here. So I'm just gonna put that aside for now. Now I'm going to move on. I wanna kind of show you how to make this shape. The, um, I'm gonna start with the shirt. The shirt is kind of like the letter T. In both places, they look like a T, don't they? So what I wanna do is get my colored paper and I'm going to make a T shape. So I am going to use this paper. This is a nice piece of paper. It has flowers on it. So I'm gonna make, now you can make a T or you can use, if you look at this person, this person's T-shirts, uh, the arms come down a little bit longer. So it's up to you. You can use a T or you can just make it look more like uh, a T-shirt. So I'm going to show you how to do it um, using a T. So we the letter T, I'm going to turn it this way. Um, the letter T kind of starts out like this, kind of comes down a little bit and comes over and back up. And this is where my arms are going to be. So you want to kind of keep it to the size of the popsicle sticks. And if it if it's a little bit bigger, you can always cut it out and make it a little smaller. So there's my T. And I'm going to cut that out with my scissors on my line. And again, my helper hand holds the paper and then moves it along. Okay, so now I have my T-shirt. Just cut that a little better. Okay, so I'm going to position that on my shirt over there. And the arms are going to stick out a little bit like that. Okay, um, next I would like to make the pants. The pants are done in a V shape. So I'm going to get a piece of paper and make a V shape out of those. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take colored paper and I'm gonna use the shape V. So for the shape V, oh, that's a little too. make a V this way and flatten it a little bit because I know that's where the waist is going to be and I'm going to bring it down and then we're going to make another V shape here for the legs and then I'm going to cut that out after that will be shoes. So what I'm going to do now, let's see how my popsicle person's looking. I have pants, I have a shirt, I have a head, arms. It's coming out pretty nicely. My next 
shape, I'm going to make uh, some sneakers. Because sneakers are fun. So I'm going to take a piece of paper. I'm going to cut my paper or uh, fold my paper in half because remember again, I'm going to use, I'm going to cut it once and measure it. Uh, I'm going to measure it once and um, cut once, but make two. Move my popsicle person over. I'm going to make the sneaker, which is an oval shape like that. Now, if you wanted to give your shoe a little heel, like this lady's, what we can do is, it's nice as I can use the back of that, I can use an oval shape and just put a little heel over there. Now, I also want to put, if you look at this one's sneakers, I can put some stripes. For the sides of the sneaker. Now remember, this is only one sneaker, so the other side is going to do the opposite. That means it's going to be the it's going to do uh, the same thing, but in a different um, order. So I'm cutting it out, helper hand, holding, moving my paper around. So since this is one heel, I'm gonna put it there. And then I can use this heel for the other side. And I can mark, remember they're gonna be opposite. So the heel on this left side is gonna be on this direction and the right side is gonna be the other direction. And I'm gonna put my stripes there on that. So my popsicle person is looking great. My next step is the fun part. I get to get my googly eyes. Now let's move him over. They're gonna go here and I'm gonna pick a nose right there and some string, which I will use. Cut out a piece of string. There we go. Somewhere over there. Now you can also go ahead and use your paper and you can make hats. You can make purses for your lady if you have a lady or your man if you'd like to have a purse, a bag, um, a ball. Those are kind of fun. I've done some uh, projects where kids make skateboards and all kinds of fun things shopping bags so now this is the fun part I get to glue all of my paper together so I'm gonna start with the head I'm gonna put the head here oops um, I'm gonna I'm going to try and get a little closer so you can see that. There we go. I'm going to move these friends over a little bit for now. Okay. Now I'm going to put the eyes, and I'm just going to use a little dab of glue. A little dab for the eyes. And a little dab for the nose. And I didn't forget the mouth. I will go back and do the mouth. Oh, and a little bit for the hair. So there's our eyes. A nose. And remember to keep, sometimes the glue uh, takes a little bit of time. Maybe it takes more than one uh, a application or a one try. You might have to do it twice to get get the uh, felt to stick to um, your pieces. Next, I'm gonna put a little bit of glue behind the shirt for the arms. And then I'm gonna put some glue on the stick. You don't wanna put a lot, just put a couple little dots because then everything becomes all gluey and hard to get out. 
Um, and then before I turn these over, now my thumbs are gonna be, make sure your thumbs are kind of facing up in the right direction. And you can put that there. And then the pants can go here. And if the glue is in the wrong place, just get a paper towel or you can just kind of pick it up and press down. Now you can also add buttons if you'd like. You can add um, sequence is kind of nice to add too. If you'd like to dress it up a little bit, I'm gonna put a little dot on each sneaker. And the pants are gonna go right above the sneaker, so I'm just gonna attach it that way. Okay, oops, to get to my table. Okay, there we go. Um, so there you have it, popsicle stick person. They have really fun to make a whole group of them um now yeah thank you so much for letting me share this lesson with you um i look forward to seeing how wonderful your popsicle stick people have come out and look forward to sharing another lesson with you goodbye for now